It's good. Hopefully we can work again sometime. Cheer sure. up for that. Sure, bless you. Thank you, you did a good job. Thank you. Thanks. Hard to read. Am I supposed to be easy to read? I find it hard to trust people. I don't, I don't think I can. Don't know if I can trust you. So, I respect that. I can't break your heart because we're not in a relationship. I can't break your trust because I'm still getting to know you, I guess, and you're still getting to know me. That being said, uh, I like this. Whatever this is, it's a start, right? Thanks. I just want to know. I don't know. You do know. You do. But you're not telling me nothing, and I'm just in a place in my life where I need certainty. I don't have a lot of time to accommodate. I just don't. OK. I don't want something that's meaningless. I want something more. I want to know if you're for real. <laughs> Sorry, I <laughs> think. I want to find that. that person to do life with. I'm not here to waste your time. I'm not. I want you to know that. I want to do this with you. And I mean it. I'm sorry. Okay. I messed up your shirt. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Don't hurt me. Is there anything that, you, that can happen if we argue or... We'll, I know we're still getting to know each other and... and that's OK. And if we fall out or anything like that or we don't agree or we get on, whatever it is, I'm cool with that, but... Don't hurt me. I saw your post. And, um... It was, like, the first time that I'd seen... Michael... in, like, six years. And it made me feel quite sick, if I'm honest. Seeing how, like... sweet and loving he was being with you. But, um... Basically... About, like, six years ago, me and Michael were, like, hanging out. And, um... It, it wasn't that long. Like, it was maybe the second time that, that I saw him. But... <sighs> we started to, you know, have sex. And, um... It started, it, like, it started to hurt. And so I told him to stop. I told him a few times, Danielle. I told him to stop. But he just wouldn't stop. And he didn't stop until... until he, he was... until he wanted to. So, um... Yeah, like... Michael raped me.
And um, yeah, and then that was like the last time I saw him. And so I think I just tried to live through it, but I think it has affected relationships and how I, how I am when I'm intimate with people. Like I've really taken on a lot of people's shit and I just feel like you just deserve to know. I wish someone had told me. I wish someone had warned me. And I, I just wouldn't want your experience to be anything like mine. <sighs> I take it he hasn't spoken to you about anything like this before. Well, he needs to man up and own up to it. Because it's going to affect his relationships. I mean, it's affected mine. I don't need him to say anything to me. I, I don't need to take it anywhere, but... <sighs> Michael raped me, like... <laughs> What's wrong? Talk to me. Who's Natalie? What, what? Who's Natalie? I should have told you. I, I know what I've done was wrong. It wasn't right. You know what you did? Yes, I know what oh, I've done. Oh, so now you can tell me. All these months I've been with you, now you can tell me. I'm ready to you, listen I don't want to listen to you. I don't want to listen, listen to you. I don't want to listen to you. I don't want to listen to you. I don't want to listen to you. It doesn't make it right what I've done. But that's not me. You know who I am. That's not me. You made me sick. You made me sick. You made me sick. You made me sick. I didn't know how to do with it. I didn't know how to say it to you. But what can I do? With you, I found someone I love for the first time in my life. I want to fix this. I really want to fix this. I loved you for full lad. I loved you for lad. This. I want to prove to you I'm a different man now. You're gonna go apologize to her. If that's what it takes, I'll do it. You're gonna go apologize to her. You're gonna go turn. You're gonna go police. Whatever you've got to do, you're gonna go do it. Wherever it takes, I'll do. I wanna make this right. I'm not gonna hide anymore. There's nowhere for me to hide. I will go to the police. I'll be a better person for you and for Natalie. I'm going to do that. I want you to know that I've been to the police. I've owned up to everything. I want to make this work, Danielle. I'm sorry. I love you, but I can't be with you. And please, you did the right thing. <laughs> 